Hey guys, so we just ordered our beneficials um, and they take about four or five days to come in. We are today letting go our Encarcia formosa, which is a white fly predator. It comes in this uh, styrofoam package with a cooling agent in there, like a cool pad. It's time sensitive. If I leave these hanging around for a while, they'll start to release into this uh, plastic bag and then they'll die inside the plastic bag. So this came in the mail today. I opened it up. This isn't something that I can wait until next Wednesday when we have class and do. These have to get out right away. So these are white fly predators. It's a tiny little wasp that lays its eggs in the scale, it's called scale of the white fly. When the white fly fly from leaf to leaf, they go on the underside of the leaf, they lay their eggs. Those eggs turn into nymphs. And when they're at the larvae stage, um, when they're actually at the pupa stage, the white fly predators come fly and they parasitize that pupa by laying eggs into it, three to four eggs of their next generation of Encarcia. And so if you have a situation like tomatoes, cucumbers, where you have white flies, you can use biologicals, insects attacking insects, because white flies are really bad. They, they fly, they can spread disease, they can come in from the outside world, they can go in between bays, and it, they really, they really do a number on the plants and they can spread disease. So we can spray insecticides or we can, spray, we can uh, release beneficials. And so the cool thing about these in Carcia, we've, we've ordered these before from Hydro Gardens, we've ordered these from Arbico. They come on little cards. The cards have little dots, which are the eggs. And so there's a little tab on that card that assists in hanging these. And what I'll do is I'll methodically go through the greenhouse and I'll hang these cards at different heights on the leaves so that when they release, they go out, they find the uh, white fly predators and they attack them. What most greenhouses do is they have these on standing order. Large greenhouses like Eurofresh have Encarcia coming in based on how many per square foot uh, and they just release uh, every two weeks and they make sure they don't have any white fly. As the population of white fly goes up and you do a release, it brings it back down and then the second generation comes out and reattacks the white flies as they begin to recover and you keep thresholds really low and you keep at it. It's not something you want to do just one time uh, type of thing because it needs to be repeated. If I release all these and get all the white flies out and it crashes, these will die too because there's nothing for them to eat. Okay, I'm releasing tonight. Thank you. So white flies love poinsettias and here's our little poinsettia cuttings. So because this is down on the table where there's spray, I don't want the young eggs to be sprayed on frequently, so I'm going to hang these up out of the spray nearby on this apple tree cutting. And so I'll hang these cards here. And then when these release, they'll take care of white flies in this area, but they'll gravitate towards the white flies here on these poinsettia cuttings.